The following is my impression of a donkey floating in space. <clears throat> Thank you. There's no sound in space, guys. Come on. Plus, the donkey would be dead. You guys are dumb. That was too far. I'm sorry for being an ass. <laughs> so, beard lovers, it's Friday. Get ready to part ways over the weekend. I won't be making videos over the weekend. I'll see you on Monday, though. I need my beauty rest. You think this comes easy? No. It takes ample. I like that word, ample. I don't use ample enough. Ample. Ample. I don't like it anymore. Rest to maintain this beauty. But that doesn't mean we can't have a good enough time today that will last us for three days. Jeez, that would take a lot of LSD. Don't do drugs. I'm ready. You ready? I got on my, my nice casual jacket because it's casual Fridays here at Weezy Studios. It helps maintain a relaxing atmosphere around here because the rest of the week I'm a hard ass. So anyway, today I'd Speaking like to- a hard ass. Oh God. What? Oh. Casual Friday. That's too casual, clone. No man should have to see his own body on another man's body. It's like in Back to the Future when Doc says if you see yourself in another timeline, it causes a paradox. More like uh, a pair of rocks, am I right? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> okay, so this will be the last Casual Friday. In other news, Shannon on Twitter pointed out two days ago that today is Jedediah Strong Smith's birthday. Thanks for the reminder, Shannon, as if I needed it. Again, I can't believe more YouTubers aren't reporting on this. I say again because back in 2011 I reported on it. I'd be surprised if all the other YouTubers aren't talking about it too. The birthday of old Jedediah Smith. Jedediah Strong Smith was a hunter, a trapper, a fur trader, a trailblazer! And I'm happy to report that some new information has apparently come to light about Jedediah Strong Smith because the Wikipedia page has changed. I shall report on it now. Jedediah Strong Smith was a clerk, frontiersman, hunter, trapper, author, cartographer, and explorer of the Rocky Mountains, the North American West, and the Southwest during the 19th century. You're welcome. <clears throat> Don't try that at home. <clears throat> I hope that someday, a few hundred years after my death, some jerk on the internet tells my story in a weird voice. In fact, let's pre-enact it with my current Wikipedia page. Craig Jean Benzine is an American video producer, musician, and vlogger. Better known on his YouTube channel, Weezy Waiter. <laughs> so Weezy. A lot of people like to make fun of my list, which is sad that they think superficial crap like that matters at all. People are so dumb and uglier than me. And they can't jump as high. I can jump higher than that. That was an example of them jumping. If anyone in life ever gives you a hard time with petty crap like that, just know that they're gonna lead sad, miserable lives. The highest level in society they could ever possibly achieve is President of the United States, so joke's on... So what's the big deal about old Jedediah anyways? Well, apparently he was the first to lead a documented exploration of many places in the West, like Salt Lake City. Not Salt Lake City, Salt Lake Frontier. If you would've found Salt Lake City, that would've meant the entire city traveled back from the future, and then they wouldn't have enough fuel to get their DeLoreans back up to 88 miles per hour to get back home. And since they're traveling through time, they might cause a paradox. More Not like a pair of rocks, am I right? <laughs> You're still here? Get to the alligator pit. <laughs> oh, 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 Rocky, Rocky. Oh. Anyway, he also explored what would become Colorado, Mojave Desert, up the West Coast, Oregon country. We learned earlier this week that that would lead to Oregon Territory having its own org exit from the UK. Quite right. But like seemingly every historical figure I talk about on here, his accomplishments weren't fully appreciated until 75 years after his death. There's an example of giving credit where credit is don't. So what we can learn from Jedediah is that to achieve ultimate fame and appreciation for what you do in life, you just work really hard at something you're passionate about, die, and then wait 75 years, and then still be dead. I think I just came up with a new version of America's Got Talent. Producers, contact me 75 years after I die, please. Also, Jedediah owned a couple slaves. Don't own slaves. That's not cool. So coffee's it seems done. Coffee's done? I love it when the coffee's done. Coffee, 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 coffee. coffee. Where's the coffee that you said was done? I didn't say the coffee's done. I said Gaddafi's done. What? He is old news. Well, he died like five years ago. See? So it seems that in order to be super famous and successful while still alive, it has less to do with talent and more to do with how good you are at self-promoting. And that's just gross. It's something that I don't even want to partake in, so I quit. You can subscribe right here, click right there, and you can support me on Patreon right here and my previous video right there. Watch me, love me. See you on Monday. Oh, and I almost forgot, click the thumbs up button, the thumbs up button. Oh my God, it's the numerical value of my worth.